Hi everyone. So this month our theme for the all summer long collaboration hosted by left-handed crafter who is Brandy. Hi Brandy. Um, is lighthouses and also we have sort of a color challenge which was pink. And at first I was like huh, that just doesn't go. It goes with what next month is but that color is different. <laughs> so we have some challenges. We don't have to follow them to the T, but I try to do that just like I do in my jewelry collab. So I'm going to show you what I used first. I used Sailing Home by Stampin' Up, the lighthouse, the birds, the compass, the little sailboat. I didn't use the sentiments out of this. I did use this die, the small sailboat, and the lighthouse die. And I did use the Happy Birthday and the sand out of Seaside Notions. These are both in our annual catalog currently on pages 31 and uh, I forget. I will try to put the links to them down below the video but it won't be immediate because I have to get them first and I did I didn't use the um, stamp set from Quite Curvy but I did use this one die here. Um, I used one piece of paper out of the whale of a Time, I think it's called. Yes, Wheel of a Time designer series papers. They're also in the annual catalog and you might have seen them just right a few minutes ago in a different collab. I used Night of Navy and um, I can't remember if this is Sahara Sand or Crumb Cake. Let me see. It's Crumb Cake because I already had it cut. I was going to use Sahara Sand then to change my mind. So I used Night of Navy and um, Crumb Cake even though um, the paper that I just showed you is really Pacific Point. So anyway, um, and then I also used the Navy Twine from the Well Suited Twine Combo Pack. That's in the January to June Mini from the Well Suited Suite. I used the one and a half inch circle punch, but I just used it as a mask. Um, I used a half of one like that. And there you see some pink. <laughs> and I did actually use the Scotch um, re resealable squ or releasable squares. They're reusable is what I'm trying to say. And I used markers in Sahara Sand Light and Dark. Uh, one in Seaside Spray, these are alcohol markers, and Mango Melody Light and Dark. And of course, Tombow, Glue Dots, Dimensionals, and Seal, <laughs> which is our, our tape runner, one of our tape runners from Stampin' Up. And, and I, okay, let me just show you. Here's what I came up with. For this month, it's a uh, it's a card. I just did a card, and what I did is I also used my blending brushes again in Magenta Madness and Calypso Coral, if I can find it. Well, you can't tell from there, but Calypso Coral and a little bit of Seaside Spray, and also you can't tell. Oh, and I did use also a scissor. Um, one of these fancy scissors at the top edge of the paper to sort of make waves along the horizon which is kind of weird looking but anyway that's what I did the quite curvy die is here for the sand so I have the sailboat sailing towards the shore where the lighthouse is and the birds are from the set um, this is up on dimensionals. This is up on dimensionals. Here's where I did the masking. If you've ever been to the shore, like I would go to the South Jersey shore sometimes and stand on the boardwalk. My favorite time to be at the shore is early morning with the sunrise and in the evening when the sun is setting. And I have seen a beautiful, maybe more, a little more orangey uh, sky, but I toned this down a little bit with some seaside spray and it started looking a little muddier so I just left it at that. So I didn't put any bling on it because I wanted it to look a little more rustic. I just put the twine here. Happy birthday. And it came out okay. I felt like I needed something here and I started to 
uh, try a sand dollar or something um, from the Seaside Notions and the scale just wasn't right so I, I le oops sorry so I left it at that and then on the inside all I did was put the compass from the set in Night of Navy. I stamped it off once and to lighten it and put it on the inside. Uh, Whisper White, Crumb Cake, and Night of Navy. So that is my lighthouse project with pink for the month of February. Um, I do hope you'll go check out Brandy's channel and all the other collab participants. They'll be linked down below. And have a wonderful weekend, everyone. Stay safe. I know it's been a rough winter for many people. I feel very blessed, but I'm also in kind of a funk and I'm hoping to get out of it soon. So do take care and I will talk to you very soon. Hugs, love, and peace.